Hi everyone, Wendy Spanish Crafter here. Every week on Facebook, on Cara Brandon's group, she gives out a freebie. And this was this week's. And I just thought it was so pretty. So I thought I would uh, cut them all out and get on with decorating the tags up. My problem I find when tags are already printed, I hate to cover things up, but anyway, we shall do our best. I've done one or two bits already. This one, um, just one of the butterfly tickets. I cut the clock in half and I've put a piece of um, lace on the bottom. And you get all these little words as well, little tiny. So I'm just wondering where to uh, put those. And I think I need something in the middle there. Maybe that ticket, but that doesn't leave me too much to use on the other two. But we'll go with it anyway. Just stick that halfway over there. And then the words are spring, love, joy, relax, floral, breathe and botanical. So I think we'll go just any two. They're all going to be used on these tags anyway, so it doesn't really matter which so I'm going to put one down there and shall stick the other one lengthways along the top there. So that's one done. I printed them on 160 GSM card so they're reasonably substantial and I shall, I've got some seam binding out which is ivory, again, from Crafty Ribbons. So I shall cut the hole and slot a piece through. Oop, catching my cardigan on the bag. So it's Sunday afternoon here in Spain, quite overcast and cloudy today. And we're in for a bit of a rainy, wet week, I believe. And it's typical because the lockdown has been lifted a little bit. And as from tomorrow, Monday the 1st, we can go to the bars. Uh, they, they're allowed to open their outside terraces. Um, so obviously, if it's a wet week, people aren't going to go and sit outside on the terraces. Um, we've arranged to go out with some friends on Tuesday uh, who we haven't met up with for quite a while uh, I've met up with Helen and I've, we've walked the dogs together um, this one I've started as well um, so what I'm going to do is just punch I'll punch them all actually while I've got the crocodile in my hand and get the ribbon threaded through and I watched uh, Cara doing hers last night uh, when I was in bed and uh, she did them beautifully. Um, I shall find the link and put it below mine here. Um, so much talent out there, isn't there? So much. Right. I love doing things like this, just pulling bits out and there's no rhyme or reason to anything. You just go with what takes your fancy. Because I've not used a grommet, I'm a bit wary of ripping the card. But you don't have to pull it too tight. So yes, I'm looking forward to going out for a drink on Tuesday. Uh, the bars have to shut at six o'clock. So we're going out at three. And we'll probably have something to eat as well. Um, we do have to show our support for everybody. It's such a shame that a lot of bars have had to close, you know, for good, because they just can't survive with not having any income whatsoever. We have a guy down in the next village to ours, and he owns a bar here, but he also owns one in Sheffield as well. And obviously his in Sheffield has been shut for a while. And when we were talking to him before this lockdown, he said if he has to shut this bar, that'll probably be the end of him as well. 
So we shall have to wait and see if he's um, still operating when we go down on Tuesday. Right, a couple of words on this one. Uh, we'll have floral because I've stuck a little rose on there. Um, which will go at the side. I like sticking words lengthways. Just gives it a bit of different. This is an old top that I got from the charity shop and it had like a lace covering over the, over the main body of it. So I've cut all that up and utilised it. So there's no rhyme or reason to stick in any bits wherever they go. And I've got another piece of lace here. I think I might just stick down the edge of this one. So that it's hanging off the side a little bit. I shall put all these in my stash and then whenever I make a journal, I've got something ready just to pull out as and when needed. And it's nice just having them sticking off the edge a little bit as well. And I've still got this half of the clock, which goes that way. Could stick that down there. Okay. Right, we've got one more ticket. Balloon ride ticket. So I'll stick that down there. I'll use the three in one for that while it's going onto the fabric. And I better get my top on there because it's all starting to volcano out. Right, what else have we got? I've got some words to play with here. Breathe, relax, love, oops, and spring. Right, we'll have spring on this one and stick it over the green trim and we'll have love on this one where should we stick that just that way and oops that's not quite too straight oh, i have to do this this is cosmic shimmer and it um grabs pretty quickly it's strong but it it does grab fairly quick so once it's down, it's down and we'll have relax. I'll put the relax with the breathe. Now, should we put some pearls on these? I've got some little tiny pearls in my stash here. Have that there. I think that needs a bit of three in one under there. I thought I'd use three in one on that one, but it's not sticking down terribly well. Perhaps didn't take it right up to the edge. Right, let's get the pearls out. Put all this lace back in the drawer. So there's the three, and let's decide where the pearls are going. I've got some white and some green at hand at the side of me. So I'll pull a few out and my sticky pencil, which is not quite as sticky as it was. So I'll just trim that off a little bit and put some dobs of glue. Let's put two there. I'll put green on those. It dries clear, so it's, just, it's okay. Right, that. Let's put three along the top there. That was bubbles. One white, one green, and one white. Where could they go on this one along the bottom here? Put 
three again on there more white have happened to fall out so I'll use same again one white one green one white and on this one along this side a bit of variation all white I think one two oops stuck together three okay so they've turned out quite pretty so they can go in the stash ready for just slotting into a journal that word hasn't quite stuck down there probably because it's on the trim Oh, it's going very black here. I think I better go upstairs and get the washing in. Okay, that's that. Thanks for joining me. And pop onto Cara Brandon's Facebook page if you're on Facebook. She gives a freebie every week. And I think this is really pretty. Uh, so thank you. And I'll see you soon. Bye.